Hey, it's Andy from SmartWP, and today we're going to show you how to change your username in WordPress. Now, if you've tried to change your username in WordPress, you may have noticed that the username field is grayed out and you're unable to change a username. But if your username is still admin, for example, that could be really bad for security. Or let's say someone quit at your job and you just want to remove them or change your, the username of the WordPress user. We're going to show you how to do it using three simple methods. So let's hop right in. Now, the first method is just to make a new username and then attribute all of the posts from the old username to the new one. So let's do that right now. So I'm gonna add a new username and just call it Andy New. Now we've made our new username here. So now we have both Andy accounts and you'll notice that I can't delete the original one, but I can delete the new one. Uh, that's because I'm currently logged in as the old Andy account. So I'm gonna go in and log into the new one. So now that I'm logged in, let's go ahead over to users and you can see I can now delete the original username that I wanted to change. So I'm gonna hit delete. And after you try to delete a username in WordPress, it'll let you attribute all of the posts to a new user. So we're gonna do the Andy new account. I'm gonna confirm the deletion. And you can see now we just have uh, Andy new and the old Andy is gone. So uh, we're gonna go over to posts and you can see now that the post that was originally attributed to Andy is now attributed to Andy new. So that's probably the easiest way to change a username in WordPress, but we're gonna go in and show you how to use a plugin also. So let's go and add new. And the plugin we're gonna use is called Easy Username Updater. And you can see it here with a thousand installs. So now that this plugin is active, if you go over to your users tab, you'll see a new option for username updater. And here you can pick any existing username and change it to a new username. So let's go over and do update to the Andy new account. And we'll just go back and change it to the original Andy username. And you can see the username is updated. So let's go to the posts. And I've logged out, of course, because the username has been changed. And you can see the username is back to the original Andy. And we've successfully changed the username again. So the last method is a little more advanced. It, we're going to use a tool called phpMyAdmin to change the username. Uh, this is uh, helpful if you actually can't log into your WordPress site and you want to change your username or see what usernames are on the site. So um, depending on your host, uh, most hosts let you access phpMyAdmin. So we're on SiteGround right now. So we're going to go over here and go to Site and go to MySQL and go to phpMyAdmin. And then this will let us access our phpMyAdmin account. So you can see we have a database here. And then you have to look for your table with underscore users in it. Uh, so this is the database table in your MySQL database that holds all the usernames. You can see under the user underscore login field, uh, we have our usernames. So let's just change the username here to Andy New. And it's as simple as that to change it with MySQL. Now, after you do this, you probably are going to have troubles logging in. Just make sure to clear your cookies and then you should be able to log in as normal. And that was three methods to change your username in WordPress. Remember, you can go to our site, smartwp.com, for the full guide. And thanks again for watching. And remember to like and subscribe.